It's the kids of culture guy. It's the kids of culture guy. I'm gonna stab you in the eyes. I'm the kids of culture. <laughs> What's up, guys? <laughs> Welcome back to a brand new video. Today's gonna be a, a quick one. You know, while everybody, every generic commentary channel out there, for the most part, is gonna be talking about Pokemon to get those easy views, uh, numbers, you know, followers, subscribers, money. Money's the most important thing on this platform, after all, you gotta flex your 1k plus. Anyway, while they're all doing that shit, I'm gonna be, you know, different, realistic. Uh, because, I don't know, I wanna have fun on this bitch. Come on, where's the fun? It's not fun anymore. So, today, instead of Pokimane, you know, the oversaturated topic that everybody's gonna talk about to be, you know... Boring? I'm gonna be talking about another individual because that's always fun, you know? I, I love you guys. You're so fucking stupid and it just... God, it just brightens up my day. So thank you. Thank you. And this person, truth be told, I don't really have anything against them. They kind of blocked me, I think, preemptively after Tommy C got mad at me because Tommy C is actually friends with this guy, believe it or not. Uh, this person's name is Vito Gijikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashikulashik
um, tweet. And anybody that's going to try to make sense of it is obviously going to be looked at in a negative light, right? Uh, we had fucking Brittany Venti, you know, just she didn't take very kindly, you know, who Brittany Venti is. You should know who Brittany Venti is. She's kind of, she's kind of fucking hot. I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> but like that's that's besides the point. Uh, she had like her thoughts on this. Uh, this is, let's pull that up. God, I'm thinking about them titties. Ah, anyway, mm, stop. That's, <laughs> she's like, pedos are monsters. What if they're non offet No, what about, no. Say no to pedo sympathizers. Now, that's probably, uh, directed at Vito Club because this is basically her reaction in real time to what, uh, Vito was saying. So, we have, uh. I'm all for conversation usually, but there's no negotiation with people who have the urge to hurt uh, children or the people who sympathize with that urge. This is like if someone had the urge to R word and you asked me to empathize with them, no one said considering talk shit. <laughs> um, she goes on to say, it'll help. Shut the fuck up. No, it won't. There are better methods. Anyone who suggests normalizing this shit is part of the problem. Again, this is directed toward Vito Kladilaba. Um, pretty obvious there. She had previously quote tweeted him and was not very, um, what was it, kind? I mean, I mean, she was like kind of cord. Like she didn't, she didn't call him a pedo or anything. You know, nobody's from what I've seen doing that aside from the, uh, you know, the people that don't really like have an internet presence, right? But it's interesting to know, you know, the people that take the cancel culture guy. Uh, seriously, right? And they're beating their chests about why they're taking him seriously because, like, I don't know, because they're, I don't know, because they're so super anti pedo that they gotta let everybody know at all times. They're not really going at Vito. Uh, from what I've seen, you know, maybe Tommy's reprimanding him. I wouldn't know because Tommy blocked me, uh, for defending the cancel culture guy, like, I don't know, four months ago or something, and that ruffled his jimmies a lot. Um, but whatever, this is Tommy's boy. Right, with with excellent takes like this. <laughs> like I don't like I don't understand it, right? It's like it's okay, look. <laughs> I'm not gonna be a dick like most people in commentary and go after the low hanging fruit, right? Um, I don't need that. So what I'm just gonna say is I'm gonna look at the, past the surface level and be like my main I guess issue or, or the question rather that I, I have is like where is that same energy? Right, <laughs> for for like uh, for example, like the people that are like, I mean, you could say like Augie's friend Connor kind of, you know, like reprimanded him a little or said something, uh, but it was nowhere near the same energy uh, he had for other people, you know, like in regards to the zero shit, right? You know, it, it's uh, it's like, it's like where's the same energy, guys? It's not there anymore. It's like, again, is it because, is it the special treatment thing? Like, I just want some of you guys to be straight shooters. Like, I, I know what you're thinking. I know what's in your heads, bro. Okay? I just want you to save all that fucking agony. Like, fucking, again, Willie Mac, right? Willie Mac was like, yeah, T-channels and commentary channels. There's not really much of a difference. Like, what the fuck? Yeah, he's willing to be a straight shooter like that. I just want you guys to say yes. Like, we don't care about risky takes like this. So long as you're good with us, or so long as you stay in line, or so long as you're cool with us. I just want that to be... Can you be transparent? Like, <laughs> you know, can we have a little bit of that? Um, I know it's very hard to find. Uh, there's a lot of authenticity that's really hard to find in commentary. All right. And I look forward to expanding on what I mean when I say commentary, commentary community, because uh, there are people out there uh, that that say that I'm part of the commentary community, and I said that I, I'm not part of the commentary, I don't want to be part of that. Um, I'd want to expand on those thoughts at a later date, because uh, that is actually a very interesting question, that is actually a good question. I need proper time to articulate that. Uh, to get a give you a good response, uh, but I think that I might have what you're looking for. In either case, in any case, that's just that's all I had for this therapeutic video. Uh, you know, apologies. I know it's like my daily bit of a little therapy, um, and uh, and I need to say it because otherwise I'd probably go fucking insane like the actual Joker. <laughs> but once again, guys, that's enough for this video. 
<sighs> appreciate all you guys. Appreciate the love and support. I hope you appreciate my epic gaming skills or whatever the fuck I offer. But until next time, guys, I love y'all. Know the show. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Goodbye. Have fun. Give me that cringe YouTube shit. I need it.